Hey you guys, this is Crow here from Crow Archer and Motorcycle Adventures and today we are here to review the Stealth Hunter from Hitman Archery. I finally got mine all the way set up exactly how I want it. This is a 62 inch recurve with a 16 inch riser and the limbs on it make it 62 inches. Now mine is rated at 50 pounds at my draw length which is 29. But at 28, on my scale, it pulls around 48 and some change. But right at my draw length, it's 50 pounds. The arrow setup I've got on it are Gold Tip Hunter XTs and 400 spine, 100 grain brass insert, 125 grain field tip. And I got this little Selway plastic top quiver on it. Uh, a purple and black string from Shatterproof Archery. Uh, D97 Flemish Twist Fast Flight. And... Let's take some shots with it. I'll tell you what I love about this bow. And to be honest, I love what you get for the money. You know, shipped to my house, it was $250, but that was after tax plus shipping. And the grip is phenomenal. And honestly, it's really light. If you're a fan of the Black Hunter recurve, I highly recommend you get one of these. This thing is amazing. I, I love this bow. Boom, it was right in there too. Slightly low, but still in that black. It's actually a pretty quiet bow and it's really stable, you know? Oh man, right in there in that black again. Take one more. I'll grab the camera and we'll go down there and look at it. Eh, that one was a little off, but whatever. <laughs> we're out here shooting for fun. It's not like we're shooting for score or nothing. I'm trying to get this camera off of my mount, so forgive me on that. Come on. Well, put this down real quick. There we go. Whoop. Now, this is a really, really nice bow. I, I really enjoy it. See. Like I said, for just throwing a couple down there, that's really not that bad. You know, as you can tell, we got a little bit of wind out here. But no, this is a great bow. You get a chance, go over to hitmanarchery.com, get a hold of Eric. He'll put one on the scale for you, tell you how much it weighs at your draw length. He'll get you taken care of. He's a super professional guy. Which is something I really, really appreciated about the whole experience. But this bow, for the price and what you're getting, to me, I honestly, truly do believe that this bow is worth more than what he asks for it. Um, I, I fully do believe that. Uh, that's, like I said, my whole goal behind building this was to find a bow that's a little bit different, something close to a Black Widow that I didn't have to spend $1,000 on. And sure enough, it fit the bill and it's awesome. So if you are considering wanting a Black Widow, why don't you pick up one of these first? Try it out to, to basically see if you're going to like a belly mounted system. Overall, I love that bow. I really, really do. It hangs right up there with my Hoyt Satori. And then my Morrison uh, Phoenix that I'm about to have built up. You know, both of those are, you know, $1,500, $1,600 bows. Next is $250 bow that I love just as much. So either way, I love you guys. Like, share, comment, subscribe if you like the content. Definitely go check out Hitman Archery. They've actually got some really, really cool bows over there for really good prices. So peace.